Hi friends, my name is Justin. I've been going to Elements for about six years now and I'm honored to share something that God's been walking me through. Galatians chapter 5 verse 22 says, The fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. As we walk through life with God, there are moments where we say yes to Jesus and we get to experience what it's like walking hand in hand with our King whose purpose is love. Isn't that beautiful? We also get to experience moments where God has a specific way of approaching a situation, caring for a friend or caring for us. And in the moments we don't choose God's best for us, we try to figure it out on our own. We choose to walk apart from the Father. This is simply what we call sin. If we're being honest, after choosing sin, we often beat ourselves up. We say things to ourselves that we would never say to another person. So what's the point? The point is that after we've chosen to sin, there's an opportunity. The opportunity is to sow the fruit of the Spirit in our hearts in those moments. So. Take a deep breath. You belong to God. Let go of anger. Let go of shame. Allow a moment for patience. Be gentle. You are a child of God, and his portion for you is his love. His kindness will lead you to repentance. Slow down in the aftermath of sin, just enough to begin sowing life. I hope that this brings some rest to your heart. And my question that I'd like for you to think about this week is, the next time you find yourself in the aftermath of sin, what is one fruit of the Spirit that you can let into your heart? So I'd love to pray a blessing over your day now. Father, I just want to thank you so much that in the aftermath of moments where we've chosen to walk apart from you, that we have an opportunity just as much to sow the fruit of the Spirit into our lives. So I pray for each and every person hearing these words right now that we would slow down in the aftermath of moments walking apart from you and let that fruit into our lives. We pray these things in your name, Jesus. Amen. Thank you guys so much.